Okay, so let's show the key object. So um, the key object is how Max can tell which keys you're pressing on the, the computer keyboard. Uh, when I say keyboard, I don't mean like a piano keyboard. That's, right. that's a different, we can do that too, but we're not, not right now. Uh, that would involve MIDI. But this is just how to detect which keys on the keyboard you're pressing, and it's a really, it's a really simple object to use. Um, there's basically two objects, key and key up. Um, the key object will show which key you're pressing by displaying what the associated ASCII code is. So let's say I hit the D key here. It shows a 100. Um, now where does 100 come from and what is this ASCII thing? So every computer on, on the uh, in the world basically like has uh, the same codes produced by the same letters. So the D key on a German keyboard will produce a 100 even though it might be in German keyboards are weird. They're like different keys in different positions. Right. They're strange. Like the Z keys are like way up in the corner. It's, it was really difficult to undo things. Um, so every key is associated with a code Number. and the code is standardized. So it's called ASCII. And here's actually a table. Uh, thank you for finding this, Sharon. Yes. So uh, this is the ASCII code uh, table. So ASCII stands for American Standard Code for Information Interchange. Um, so here are sort of printable characters, let's like A through Z, capitalized. Oh, and the capital letters have different codes than the lowercase letters, by the way. Um, also, what's confusing sometimes if you're if you're wanting to use the number keys, uh, the number keys have codes that are not the same as the number you're pressing. So the code for the six key is not six, it's 54. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that's confusing. Um, when in doubt, reference a table. <laughs> yeah, or what I always do is I just turn on the key object and press the key I want to map to something and then use that number, whatever number pops up. So, um, like, for instance, the G key here is going to be 103. Um, all right, so, and we can see there's, like, uh, there's also another object called IOTA, or sorry, I-T-O-A, which is uh, uh, integer to ASCII. So ASCII is the codes we're talking about. But if you have a number and you want to turn it into the letter, so uh, you can run the number into IO, uh, ITOA and prepend a set on there, which makes it turn that code in, uh, make, which makes it display that in the message box, and we'll say that's a G. And if I hit Shift G, it should be capitalized because that's a 71. So um, key will tell you what key is being pressed, and only tells you one at a time. And um, also key up which is um, sort of very similar to key, but it tells you when you've released the key. So let's see, I'm gonna hit the F key. Um, let me add a button in here. So add a button there, and I'm gonna copy and paste the button over here so we can see when it actually triggers that number. So if I hit F, that fires, and if I let go of F, key, the key up fires. So they're both the same code, 102, 102. But one's reporting when you press down on the key, and the other one's pressing when you uh, reporting when you mm -hmm. let go of the key. Um, num key, I always forget what num key does. Interprets numbers typed on the keyboard. Um, so num key is like, oh, okay. Well, we'll have it. Let's do a, a different thing of different video on num key. Um, yeah. But that's basically how you tell which key is uh, being pressed and we have and, a different demo for right. how what to do next so. well and, and before we move on though the the application for this just so that we're kind of clear is that by understanding and knowing the numbers on the keyboard now your keyboard can become a controller as such oh yeah of course so yeah. i mean essentially that's one of the values of this is that now your keyboard and all of the characters on it can become triggers. Right. So each each individual key you could use to trigger a sound file to play back or a video file to play back or all An kinds image of to anything, change yeah, anything or you want, really. volume up or what, yeah, whatever. Yep. Anything. Yep. Okay, great.